are you becoming like a blogger or what? Influencer? Yeah. I, you know, I, I don't decide these things. Sometimes this guy shows up and then we do something and he decides. Hi, I'm Robert Gerstmann. I'm Chief Evangelist and Co-Founder at Cinch. This is the Stairway to Heaven. <laughs> Yes. Okay, Monday, September 9, in which the tech giant is expected to unveil its latest mobile phone, iPhone 16. That's Monday. So I'm guessing this is something you're pretty excited about. I am very excited about it. V! Oh, hi! <laughs> will you be able to sleep this weekend? No. No, I don't think I will I, be I won't be, no. no. It's like... <laughs> Wired, <laughs> waiting for it to drop. No. <laughs> I mean, it's going to be probably the biggest step change in the business messaging industry for, I don't know, 10, 15 years. Apple is releasing the new iPhone, and not only that, they're also releasing iOS 18. And with that release, RCS will come to iPhones. And that's a big piece of news. Yes! Yes! <laughs> hey, Janne. Janne, question, come. Perfect. How excited are you about the coming of RCS to iPhone? I'm very excited. I'm pretty pumped. I'm super excited. Super yeah. Excited. I mean, yeah, I use an iPhone. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so far, only been available on Android handsets, and it's now coming to iPhones. And that's a big deal. Finally, we're stepping into the next level of technology, usability, everything. It's going to be amazing. What's being released now is iOS 18, uh, the first version. This will within quotation marks, only support the consumer version of RCS. Have you had coffee? My understanding is that in the first iOS 18 release, RBM will not be available. RCS will be, but not RBM. And then in 18.1, which is coming in mid Q4, uh, then RBM will be available. So the business messaging parts. Yeah, it's so a stepping it. stone again. It's not like the but final destination. Is. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. What I will be doing is when the new iOS comes out, here it becomes very nerdy. Looking at the messaging settings, seeing that RCS is there, and then finding a friend who has an Android and sending some pictures to see them arriving and having a chat. A lot of speculation, a lot of expectation, but so far, this is all just talk. Let's see in a few days what happens. I just installed it. Woo! <laughs> I'm gonna go into messages. And if I scroll down, there is now an RCS setting. And if I go into it, it is automatically turned on. Yay, okay, do you wanna send me something? I will send you something. Yeah, so when I went in previously, it just said I was sending her a text message. Now it says text message RCS. And I just sent her a message and it said delivered. And then it said read and it gave me a timestamp of when she read the message. So exciting. Awesome. Did you get the reaction? I got the reaction. Oh, and it's cute little heart. Last week when we were doing this, it just showed up as I think my number loved a message. Oh, I see you typing now. So let me send you the photo that I sent last week and let's see if it actually delivers as a photo this time. The quality of the photo looks great. You know, last week when we were playing with messaging and testing it back and forth, the experience was awful. It was sending me to a website and it had me enter all sorts of codes and I couldn't get it to work. Cinch has been sending RCS business messages for years now. And I think marketers haven't fully embraced it, but they should now that Apple's going to be supported uh, soon as well. We're here to educate and support them through the journey. It's our job to kind of work with them, guide them in that transition, move from sort of this text to more of a richer conversational experience. Major milestone today. We will be at Inbound, one of the biggest marketing conferences there is. And it's going to be super exciting to hear what all those marketers are thinking when it comes to RCS. Okay, we're done. Awesome. I'm only five. Ah, that's going to be okay. I'll blame you.